gods on the earth. I come in the name of Lord Supreme, wise mind of law. Build on what you want today, Supreme Mathematics. Today, Supreme Mathematics is wisdom, outside for all being born of wisdom. When you think about wisdom, Cypher, you think the experiences that are indicative to a person's life situations and circumstances. You think about the things that they have learned through their past experiences and sticking with them, grown from, and elevated to another level and state of mind. You know, when dealing with wisdom, Cypher, you have to be very, very meticulous and careful when adding on to the cipher because the truth of the matter is that a lot of times we don't use our best judgment when dealing with a person place of thing when it comes to a certain situation or circumstance that transpires or takes place one thing for sure that I learned throughout my wisdom build destroy years is um it's, it's a, always an actual fact to hear that experience is the best teacher. And experience is the one that's going to best teach you about life situations and circumstances, either one way or another. So, with that being said, when you take it to the 1 of 40, the Wisdom Cipher degree in the 1 of 40, it says, what is the prescribed law of Islam of said person of that ability? And it says, that the civilized be held responsible for the uncivilized and must be punished by Islam. Now, the fact of the matter is, the prescribed law or the prescription that we give to the masses is the truth. Why? Because along with your experience should come some slips and falls, some, under, some misconceptions, some mishaps, and maybe some setbacks to help you see the truth of the matter of where you went wrong at and what can you do to do it better this time around you feel what I'm saying dealing with a situation and circumstance you have to always use best judgment you have to be able to circumnavigate and look at things in a circumspect type of angle and view because you don't want to have your view misconstrued with objects that are obstructing your view so, with all that being said, you got to just take the time to really use your experience as your teacher to teach you about a situation that you have faced prior to or are going to face. And most of the time, when it comes to building on new experiences and situations, you have to be person that's wise and insightful. You have to be the person that knows because wisdom is a manifestation of what you know, what you've learned through the years, and what you acquired as information through your stream of consciousness, look, listen, and observing. So, what I'm saying to you is that Always make sure that you are always on your square when dealing with the truth. And the supreme alphabet is T. That's truth is square. And the truth comes in many shapes, forms, and fashions. But it's undisputable evidence, facts, and cannot be denied. It will not be denied. Either it's going to be accepted or rejected. So, for me, I remember there was a time where I was always in denial about a lot of my responsibilities and duties as me growing up being older. And what happened is that experience or the situation that I was faced with, I had to come to an ultimatum and was with many different choices to make. Either I'm going to take the responsibility and duties as a man to handle what I got to handle, or I'm going to let society or life itself teach me all over again. It's like I said in my prior video. Life in the universe is like school. Whatever you don't learn, you're doomed to repeat. So, what I'm saying to you brothers and sisters out there, is learn from your experience. Because it's truly the best teacher, 
and it's truly going to guide you in the right direction of where you need to be and where you want to go in life. And with that being said, take care. Have a blessed day. I'm on my way to the justice, cipher born, to add on, and to increase my capital and revenue. So I'll see you then and build you in the near future. Peace.